We're also looking at how the Choctaw community is reacting to today's arrest. News 9's Cameron Joyner talked to Choctaw High School's Palm coach, who says they're ready to start moving forward. Following this morning's arrest, people in Choctaw say they're ready to heal as a community and that this will only make them stronger. As we all start to heal, I think that forward is the only way to go. Forward together. As a community, you've really seen everyone bond together. Choctaw Strong. Everybody's doing whatever it takes to help the kids feel more comfortable. Choctaw Strong is just the representation of how we all got so much closer in that moment when we all needed to be there for each other, and we did it. Layla Cochran and Hannah Rowe were on the sidelines with their fellow Palm teammates when gunfire erupted Friday night. And it's hard to feel safe after everything that happened, but just trying to keep a positive mindset and remember that everyone's trying to help us and that's their main priority. Layla echoed her fear. I think we're all a little nervous to get back on that field. But also the feeling of support. But we all feel a little safer at knowing that Choctaw is going to make us a plan and that we will have a plan and know what to do. Both students say the outpouring of support has been overwhelming. We've been instructed to talk about it in class and have open conversations about it. No one wants us to be scared and traumatized all the time and let that take over our whole entire lives. So I think just knowing that there's people that want to help and want to help us move forward. They say Wednesday's arrest is a step in that direction. Having a suspect in custody, I think, makes everybody feel a little bit safer and stronger and now they can look ahead. They're working on a game plan for our upcoming homecoming game to help everybody feel confident and safe and encouraged to be here. One step at a time. In Choctaw, Cameron Joyner, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.